Grand Old Partisan celebrates more than 16 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I salute Paul Laxalt, born in Nevada on August 2, 1922. After serving as a medic during World War II, he attended law school at the University of Denver and soon became a district attorney. In 1962, he was elected lieutenant governor. Sadly, the Goldwater presidential campaign dragged him down to defeat for the U.S. Senate by 48 votes. He rebounded two years later by winning the governorship. Governor Laxalt's top achievement was introducing corporate gaming, which curtailed organized crime and boosted tourism. His friendship with Ronald Reagan began when the two governors worked together to protect the scenic beauty of the Lake Tahoe region. In 1974, Laxalt won the first of two terms in the U.S. Senate. He backed his friend for the presidential nomination against Gerald Ford and then against George H. Bush. The respected senator declined to be majority leader. During much of the Reagan administration, he chaired the Republican National Committee and was a key advisor to the president. Laxalt was eulogized as, quote, a light and a compass, a testament to what a man should be. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, the more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandoldpartisan.com.